Hello everyone, welcome back to Technic Force Tutorials. In this video, I'll show you how to add your own API key to TubeTarget. Let's get started. TubeTarget keeps your account isolated and safe from everyone else using the application. And we do it by enabling you to put in your own API key that you can create very easily under 2 minutes from console.developer.google.com and you will just be pasting it here. And in this video, I will show you exactly how to do that. And to do that, click here to create an API key. And it will take you to console.developers.google.com. And you might need to sign in. So just sign in first. After that, you will get a screen like this. Now, click on Tube Target API key. And you will see the list of your projects. Now, click on New Project. And you can call this project anything you want. I'll call it Tube Target My App API Key. So give it your name however you want. After that, click on the Create button. And you will see on your notification section that your project is being created. And when it's done, you will see a screen like so. Now again, tap on the Tube Target API Key button and make sure your new app is selected. And again, you will see a screen like so. And you will see on your API overview that no data is available for the selected time frame. So now on your API library, the API you want to use is YouTube.data API version 3. So search it on the search bar and then click it from here. Then click on Enable. Now that the API is enabled, you will see a screen like so. Now on the sidebar section, click on Credentials. And you will be notified that to use this API, you may need credentials. So click on Create Credentials to get started. Now select which API you are using. Different APIs use different auth platforms. And some credentials can be restricted to only call certain APIs. Now select an API. I'll select the YouTube Data API version 3 that we have added. Now choose what data you will be accessing. You can select User Data or Public Data. I'll select Public Data, then tap on Next. You will now see your API key. Copy this API key, go to your Tube Target settings, and paste in your API key. Then click on Save and you'll be notified that your API key is now updated. And you can click on Done on your APIs and Services section. And you will see a list of your API keys. You can just copy it from here whenever you need it. And there you have it, how to add your own API key to Tube Target. I hope you find this video helpful. Thank you for watching and see you on the next one.